Hello. So here in this video, I am going to demonstrate the Aurora project that I have implemented. The implemented designs can be seen in Aurora YouTube and the extension of BHP file. Here it consists of two entities. One entity is Aurora 8B Tenby extension which is used at the transmitter side and it takes data for, as input and it has four different channels of data width 16 bits and one channel of that of output data width 32 bits. And similarly there is another entity that is Aurora it will be the receiver extension that has opposite IOs than the that than the transmitter one and is used at the receiver side. So let's run our test. So the test bench can be seen here. So here we have an instance or instance of an instance of Aurora transmitter wrapper and, and Aurora signal wrapper. So so when we open Aurora transmitter wrapper so you can say we have here a frame generator our channel extension and Aurora 8B 10B IP similarly for receiver wrapper we have frame checker our channel receiver extension and Aurora RX IP so the both of the RX and TX IPs are connected in the test bench okay. in the test bench here RX is connected with the TX so now let's run the simulation let's uh, run the simulation for 30 microsecond now as it is a big IP so it will take some time to run and once it is complete I will demonstrate you everything that is happening here and I will confirm the data that is being transmitted and received let's see so we have a valid data. Let's wait till 30 microseconds. So the test has run. Now see the frame, frame generator. So when we are seeing the frame generator, the data initially supplied is A B C D, A B C D, and here we can see that the both source is ready and destination is also ready. So we can say that the data it must be present. The data as both of the source and destination are ready, so data must be transferred. So, from 
frame generator when we see the probability and substantial here we see that the lower 16 half of data is present here and upper 16 half of data is present here and check the channel here is both of the channels are active and are also ready so let's see if this data is provided to transmitter when we see the yeah when we see the output of the our extension here we can see you can see that the valid bit is high and the 32 data is successfully provided to transmitter moving forward to the transmitter here you can see the data is present at the input or side of the transmitter so in here the txp and tx and signals are being used for transferring data now let's see at the receiver side here at the receiver side rxp and rxn are also working uh, are receiving data and here we can see that rx data and data valid are being toggled let's see what valid data is available so when data valid is here let's see it. yes so you can see that the data being transferred is successfully received here by the receiver and uh, now our rx extension so our rx extension for receiver works in a way that it has channel up signals as it, it is taking input from a 32 bit channel and it has output of 16 bits so two channels must be used to improve in appropriate 32 bits so here we have a channel up signal for channel 1 and 2 in which the 32 bit data is divided in between channel 1 and 2 with lower half in channel 1 and upper half in channel channel 2 similarly there is the channel 3 cross 4 channel up and when this signal is up the data is divided between channel 3 and channel 4 so in our scenario i am testing by turning both of the channels as up so ideally data should be present on all the channels the lower half will be present on channel 1 and 3 and upper half will be present on channel 2 and 4 so let's see if it's being followed or not let's see here we here you can see that the channel 1 contains when valid contains our valid data and similarly the valid data is present in all the valid instances so let's try another thing let's change frame to let's force it to some value let's say 1 2 3 4 Let's run in for another 10 microseconds and see what will happen. It is forced. Now let's see at our extension. We can see that our, our extension is providing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 data. And let's see at the Aurora transmitter. The data is successfully supplied to Aurora transmitter. And then 